Oh my god, I'm so disgusted. Eight years, ladies and gentlemen. Eight years, and you don't have any questions for my family. I do. It says here that you could be entitled to $3,148 per month in California if your heart condition is so severe that it could threaten your life if you if you work. But wait a minute. You're saying it's so severe, don't give me any money. But so, Teresa, you then agree that nobody in California with a heart condition that could threaten your life should not they shouldn't get any money that you want them to go to work right you don't think they should get that three thousand one hundred and forty eight dollars per month why wouldn't i go ahead turn me in i didn't claim it so why wouldn't i have just written on that per month damn i'd have hella money what so explain to me why i don't collect disability then so wait a minute it's either your claim that it's not life-threatening and not a big deal, not enough to get disability for, okay, in which your story is paranoid, reactionary, and also totally fake. Or that I, what, you know I'm not getting $3,148 per month, but you as a family have decided that I ought not to. Everybody else gets the heart condition, so either it's so bad that it's life-threatening, which is your claim, in which case the law would say I get $3,148 a month and you disagree. You think that I should risk my heart is either in such bad conditioning that it's legit life-threatening or it's not. And <laughs> you're telling me to go stand on my feet work at Starbucks, okay, and, and go be stressed out by all this shit you guys are doing. And it's either bad enough to meet your claims of paranoid reaction for eight years of coming from the care of your heart. You don't have one. That's your dis disability. You might want to check to see if my sister has a heart, because I'm pretty sure that's your fucking disability. And, uh, yeah, no. So you either have decided somehow that I shouldn't get that money. Clearly, I don't have it. You're not going to find any record of it, and you know I don't get it. So... The state of California would then deem, if your story was true, I should get a lot of money per month. And you're saying, no, we live in a sovereign nation of where we're control freaks about Tara, interestingly enough. Always were, weren't you? Always were my whole fucking life. And so you don't want me to have any money and you want me to go to work, in which case your claim is not substantiated. It's either bad enough to where I would deserve over $3,000 a month or it's not bad enough. Which is it? Were you paranoid and reactionary, or do you agree with the state that I should get over $3,000 a month given, not earned? And if I shouldn't get that money, why not? Because it could lead to drug use. But wouldn't it challenge my heart more to go to work when it's, not, it's against the state and the doctor's advice and be stressed out only to make less money than this and end up as a result of stress and whatever, doing more drugs that I don't do? Well, it doesn't make any sense. Do you want to explain your rationale or you just want to continue to be heartless wonders around the world? My God. Can we please send these criminals away? I want to. I don't care about your money. I care about your freedom. You're trying to take my life, my freedom, and the welfare of my child? Yeah. You, you guys seriously need to be locked up. There should be a new word for evil. There really should.